tell you a little bit about her she is how old Eight nine months. weeks and maybe a few days yeah she was a surprise gift for my um wife's early birthday and um we also i also wanted a guard dog for the house so that's why i got her as well because i'm also thinking about pursuing the military in the near future which we'll talk about that another time her and zavalia are a month apart well, a month and a half apart. Yeah. Snow was born June 25th of this year. Yeah. So another thing about her, um, I didn't realize how smart they were. Out of all my experience of um, having a dog and things, she's learned the fastest out of all of them. I think in three days, we taught her how to, uh, she learned how to walk on the leash. She's potty trained, pad trained. Um, what else does she learn? She learned how to sit certain like commands. She knows yeah, she already. Knows how to sit. That was uh, taught her. Sometimes come. She's learning come. Now the only issue I have, I, but I believe that's with all puppies, is the chewing, and I believe it has to do with teething. So she did damage my wall a little bit because I bought a picture of her trailer, and the whole walls are made out of sheet rock. So she did chew a certain section of that. But all in all, she's a really good, amazing dog. She's really calm. She's very family oriented and get along with um, pretty much anyone. Um, she's still scary a, a little bit um, when she's out in public with, around other people or other animals, but we're socializing her. So we uh, take her on walks to kind of get her used to other people so she don't be aggressive when she's older. Her best friend is our other dog, which is our pocket bully named Bongo. Yeah. And, um, so she's she's good with, with kids. Her. Really good. As with you kids. see, she was just checking on Zavali because Zavali was talking to her. Thanks. And as Zavali is saying hey to the camera there, <laughs> she's looking at the light act, the, the ring Say light. Hey, everybody. Using. Was there anything mm. that you left out? Her breast ain't. Oh, about <laughs> that. Okay, so so for so what we have her eating is um what what kind of um Victor pet food. Um I have the video of us uh explaining everything. Yeah, so to we'll you guys, yeah, so I'll uh, add that in here. We'll add that all in there. We shot that like what last week? A few days ago, I think. Yeah, a few days ago and we're doing this one because last one we did we had the fan running in the AC so it couldn't really hear us. But she's a really good dog though. She's like one of my favorite breeds, breeds so far, but she's bongo's my top Yeah, one. she's very smart. She, um, I think he already said she was potty trained in a few days. I mean, she still has a few accidents, but. And my, uh, did you want to talk about making, uh, uh, did you want to talk about them making, uh, her a service dog? Oh, you? yeah, um, I'm gonna end up making her a service dog here soon, um, for my seizures. So she'll eventually learn how to do all that for me. That was a big group. I know. <laughs> so I look down. But she's gotten really big. She was, um, whenever she was eight weeks, she wasn't this tall. So she did get a little bit bigger. Sorry. I just wanted mm -hmm. to bring Zavali a little closer so you can see her. Oh, yeah, look at her little bow. Say hey, everybody. That's Zavalia. Hey. Snow, where do you think you're going? Snow's trying to get off the bed because <laughs> she's actually trying to get Thank to Bongo, you. which Bongo is actually right there, my best friend. So that's also her best friend. And uh, that's what she's trying to get off the bed to get to. Where do you think you're going? 
and um, I'm putting the camera back. Um, she does not have the dew claw, I think it's called. Yeah, the dew claw that the um, purebred uh, pure nieces have. And she may look all white in the video, but she actually does have some off white to her. I forgot what they called it. Um, like a them? cream. Yeah, here. I forgot what they what they called it's it. It's on her ears and some of her body, but she looks white. But if you bring her closer, like, uh, really hard to see with the bright light, but she's like a little off cream here. And then she, and then she has, like, uh, let me see. She has, you see the spots here and then there, and then like gray right here near the tail area. That's gray. I was told like the um, purebred uh, pure nieces when they uh, reach um, maturity adulthood, those colors go away. I don't know. She is very stubborn. Um, we take her for walks and she just sits on the ground. Like she does not care. If there's a car coming, she does not care. She would lay there. <laughs> yeah, every time a car comes, she would just lay on the ground and just sit there. But Lisa's. Just... Oh, we got throw up. Oh, I got it. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, guys. We got technical difficulties at the moment. Yeah. Yeah, she just ate. She's trying to get the bongo. So, yeah. Um. What else? Oh, she won't reach her max height or weight until she's three years old. Because that's whenever they will... Mature. You telling her? She used to be, um, whenever she would eat with Bongo, at first she growled at him, but we broke her out of that. Yeah, she still got down um, over that dog bowl. Yeah, she does. As soon as she started <laughs> eating Bongo leaves and let her finish her food, and then he'll sit back over there after she's done eating. Um, Sometimes they'll eat together. What else? She's very playful. What else am I missing? Oh, she likes the water, but she don't like to go too deep in the water. Oh yeah, I kind of, uh, <laughs> I kind of did a Lion King moment when we was on the. She wants to play with Bongo. Oh, she so I did do a Lion King moment though. We was walking on the pier and the water was really deep, and I pushed her over. I can <laughs> swim, so I would have saved her, but I pushed her over. To overcome her fear of the water and she just swam all the way from the really deep end of the, the uh, water ocean and swam all the way to shore and then we did it together um, then, me and the other dog then one time terry went back i think to go get bongo or he went back to get the fishing poles or something and i was doing like a tiktok and she was just relaxing and next thing i know i just hear a splash in the water Oh, she jumped out of and she leash. jumped out of her leash. The leash was just connected. And she went under the the pier. the pier, and I tried to get her to come over to the ladder, but there was jellyfish over there, so she couldn't go over there. Yeah, I had to go jump in. Luckily, the Terry way. got her because I was leaning over the thing. I could have reached her. So. Another thing, this is um the channel all about the Browns. It is a family channel, so I do want to do better with incorporating our dogs also in our videos, some of our videos too. And I hope we get snow this year because I would love um, to get that old video them playing in the snow <laughs> in her first snow day. That would be pretty cool. Bully is mad. Bongo, did Bongo experience the snow day? He did. He liked it. He was jumping around like a bunny rabbit. <laughs> Remember? Yeah. I just got to get him a jacket because he doesn't have like... Yeah, he doesn't have much fur. I mean, he has fur. We're not like the pits and the bullies that would have like fur like that so i'm going to give him like a little doggy style flight jacket or something yeah the wolf of new york edition you but yeah you know was... let, me, let me pull it up close this you got anything to say she's a woman of very few words <laughs> is there anything you would like to say buddy she's staring at the ring light right now is there anything you want to say to the audience before we leave like hi, anything? <laughs> no, she's just being chunky. Well, that's all for now. We'll keep you guys posted with the next episode. <laughs>